stretched out from all the things it seems. You hear me? You got to hear me clear. All the things it seems. Everything ain't what it seems, nigga. And it's the product that they gave back to you for you to get the remedy of the Everything ain't what it seems. And this is the product they gave back to you for you to get the remedy. That shit deep. You need the remedy to make it out. This for, this for OG boss let me believe it. Something for real. Look, I'm a soldier, but all the weight on my shoulders make me feel like I'm a no. Feel like I'm a no. That's a good one. I'm a soldier, but all the weight on my shoulders make me feel like I'm a no. Feel like I'm a no. All these things make a real nigga turn strange. We do it all, he stay the same. 17 going up the road, drop down with chains. Long nights I split the long hat, make me cold. Killers trying to play me close, so family trying to fuck me over. They won't lock me up, I beat him once. Gotta get away, trying to beat him two times. Hit it bad right now, trying to shit. He said he beat her once, gotta beat her two times. Meaning the feds, right? Okay. Them people. He saying that I'm gonna toot this sugar while the sugar dirty. That fitting now, he know. They is out trying to kill you. Find your ass murder. Oh, wait, he said you in a compound in a mansion for the chain right now. What he saying? Gotta go back. Did that bag. Bitch, who I've been with since I was a child. She was fed on most of my ops and seen me in a while. Before I kick it sick and first, I'm gonna die sick. Everything I got seen in a pop. Just know I'm with you, you on a compound. I'm in a mansion, feeling chain. He said, I'm with you on a compound. I'm just in a mansion with chain. Ooh. Now you know everything that would have seen. That boy going hard. Because he talking about some real shit. I get it. I get it. Young boy did it. He grabbed the young folks, the masses. Cause I really wasn't on young boy like that. I was on young boy, but not that much. But now I think I listen to his music now to see what he's saying since he's been going through so much real shit like this. It's crazy. Um, but let me finish the song. I go back to that. Trying to knock it from off the map. They trying to kill this nigga. He said, I'm on drugs. I got a problem. They gonna lock me up if they know I'm dirty. They play. Oh, man. He, he talking some futuristic shit right now. <laughs> you ain't gotta deceive a man that's curious. That nigga wanna do it anyway. You don't gotta lie. That nigga say in jail, him and his dog got hooked on food, so he sued for that. Him and his dog got hooked on food. Dog food. Heroin. This boy was on heroin? I ain't even know this shit. It's crazy. I be listening. You got to listen to what these rappers saying. This nigga is telling. Ooh-wee. Don't approach him with no tools, ain't no screws out his hat. He gone. He going whatever. He gonna beat this again. He let y'all know. He letting them know. Y'all better back up. Ooh. We gotta keep from going on, but yeah, shout out to C Murder. Niggas don't even know this beat. This, I watched this review. This nigga talking about some Texas or something. What he said, I don't know. This Louisiana shit, boy. That nigga pulled his pants down. Look, and that pulled his pants down. That's that gay shit. Cause niggas get caught with they paying down fucking them dudes in jail. <laughs> hundred pounds. Yeah. He a shoot a hundred rounds. This boy look like a damn skeleton. 
He tall and skinny and bones. Ah, that's enough. That's enough. I like I said, I just listen to his music to check on his mental health because young boy gonna tell it all. He ain't gonna keep no secrets. But like I said, young boy pull in the masses, right? The young folks to get all his fans. So once he got them, he could do like petitions. You know, he can have people really rallying for him and having his back. Don't young folks gonna do that? Now the old folks listen to him now because they young folks listen to him. So young folks put the older folks on for real, for real with the young boy. I'm not even really old, but yeah, I'm older. So they put you on. So you, so you like, damn, why are these kids so obsessed with this person? So you listen to him like, hmm, this shit crazy. This shit crazy. Now it's to the point where young boy is actually an adult because he's going through adult things. Friends ain't really your friends because, you know, he's a millionaire. So he got all these fake ass people around him. Baby mamas just want to get pregnant. Girls just want to get pregnant and have his baby trial these white folks in the system pulling his, his tour bus over finding drugs and guns and shit locking them up this child support shit this media shit all in his life all the time these record labels he's got to put out music constantly like this kid ain't no kid no more. this a real grown ass man and he been developing for a long time and now he's He's cracking. Like, if you're a grown-up, a, a person with a mind who been through some shit and can pay attention and see through the blur, because when you're adults and people go through things, they don't always come direct with their problems and what's really going on. Sometimes you got to see, you got to pay attention and really hear. And young boys are young adults, which going through some real-life shit with all of us probably have been to the court system, speeding ticket, who knows. We done been through that. Baby mama drama. Um, some of y'all been through that. I don't got that problem. Um, fake friends, smiling your face and shit. You been through that. Um, you know, just making the wrong decisions, choices. You been through that. So this boy is really a motherfucking kid, adult. We have seen transition. Now, the young folks are not really even into him really that much no more because they can't understand what he's saying. <laughs> this boy going over everybody's head. But if you've been through some things, you know, young adult, even kid, teens go through adult things. But, you know, that mind, you can understand what this boy's saying. Back then, I really couldn't understand because it was a whole bunch of, you know, 38 baby. Now it's like, now it's like, I got to beat them two times. Who is them? Oh, you're talking about them folks, young boy. Now it's, now it's, you know, evaluating in your circle, cleaning things up. You maturing. Mm -hmm. And a lot of his fans ain't going to be his fans no more because they not understanding NBA young boy's close. But I am happy for young boy. I'm still watching him, like I said, because... I don't know what's going to happen. I'm praying for young boy. He be covered and protected because this dude, to start of the video, I mean, he was in a casket. Just like, whoa, that was like, wow. Is he dying? That was something's going on with him internally we don't know about? Like, he is sending real deep messages. His lyrics are so simple but so powerful, too. He says he's 100 pounds and will shoot 100 rounds. That just stood with me because, like, you like a young man that cannot be healthy for him to be that that small and that tall. <laughs> but he said he on drugs. So we need to really pay attention because this boy is really telling us something. Don't be trying to hop on a train either later when it be an article out about a young boy and maybe some trouble because it's coming and he know it. That's why he telling us right now. And people going to think, oh, it's gangster shit. People going to think it's the street shit. No. This straight business that's going on. And this man is so popular. He going to have a lot of backing because real niggas recognize what's going on. And this boy is trying to get away. He don't like it. <laughs> he's stuck. Oh, oh, he's stuck. But... What we're going to do is, like I said, pray for young boy. And because he wants to be there. And they don't want him to be. They want him to be a demon. They want him to be Cloudy Boy. 
fine because you know young boy's gay. Nothing's wrong with him being gay, but he's gay. He's gay. His fans won't like him no more. If he really came out and said he's gay, he's he pulling his pants down now on video with his booty out. He is gay, okay? Uh, you know, he's just tired of faking. You know, he's a, a flower boy. He's a rainbow kid. And they trying to make him into this monster. <laughs> and he tired. He's like, I don't want to be 38 baby no more. Let me go home, be my 10 kids, my baby mamas. That's all I want to do now. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of acting gangster. I'm tired of going to court. I'm tired of this. They got to keep making that NBA young money. That money off that boy. He set the bar too high. He set the bar too Woo-wee, that boy. YouTube streams. Man, you know he's, even though he don't win the many awards, his, his bank is fat. Mm, I'm just saying. Yo, that's my NBA Yo Boy review. Um, Jungle Remix. Check that out. Tell me he deep in that. Man, that boy deep in this shit, boy. He don't want, he don't want nobody to ever go through what he has to go through for this money. And he letting us know shit ain't what it seems. He said it on the, on the, at the beginning of the song. That's the way I look at the song. People were looking at it probably totally different than what I look like perceive it but that's how I see it because I am a musician and as far as that level and that stuff I know you got to do those extra things to be at those people's success I mean whoo